Welcome back to the channel. If you're new around here, my name is Eric. Somewhere in that camper is my wife, Marissa. We've spent the last almost three years traveling around North America in that truck camper, exploring Baja, Mexico, Canada, and 47 of the US states. Today, we're here in Moab, Utah, and we are about to take you to one of the most iconic tourist destinations of all the US, whether you're an RVer or a traveler. We're going to Arches National Park. As you may be aware or may not be aware, you're not allowed to film inside any of the national parks and then use the footage on YouTube. I believe you can actually be told that you have to take your footage down. So we're gonna take a bunch of photos and put them all together into a photo montage and here's the photo montage of our entry into Arches National Park. <laughs> Zach Galifianakis, how about that ride in? Hello, how about that ride in? So before we go on a hike up to any of the arches, we are gonna make some breakfast. So I've got kind of a weird breakfast sandwich here that I concocted, two eggs that I sprinkled leftover pulled pork into the eggs while they were cooking, and then we had some hamburger meat that needed to be cooked, so I made a little smash burger patty and buttered the absolute crap out of the bun almost too much. But that butter is delicious now that I'm eating it. Mmm. So good. I'll call it the brunch burger. Now that lunch is all finished up, we are geared up for the outside. It's chilly and windy out there, but we're gonna go back into photo mode for our walk up to the arch.
So we just got back from what we thought was going to be about a half mile hike each way. Turned out to be 3.2 miles round trip. We were greatly unprepared in terms of water. We had none. I managed to at least wear some hiking shoes. Marissa rocked it in sneakers. But we're gonna get back in the truck because we're running out of daylight here and we wanna go check out some more arches. So we drove through the park a bunch and are now going to check out three other or four other arches. We're going to see double arch, turret arch, and also north and south window, I think. Maybe we'll make it to all of them. Maybe we won't. It's all spur of the moment. Travels for us here anyway. We didn't expect to be in Moab or in a national park for Easter, but here we are. awesome day we had at Arches and now we are gonna go find some food and some drinks and figure out where we're gonna sleep tonight. Just getting to camp now. It's too dark to see anything here. We kind of had a hard time figuring out a good spot. We are on the edge of a cliff, so I'm pretty hopeful that we're gonna wake up tomorrow with some beautiful views. But until then, we'll pick you guys up in the morning. Bye. Wow, it's pretty out here. Marissa's still sleeping. I didn't want to disturb her. When we got here last night, I knew that there was going to be a big steep drop off to our right, but I did not expect that the view was going to look like this. This is gorgeous. We slept so good here. It's nice and cold. Got the diesel heater going. It's probably 38 degrees out when I last checked my thermometer. But what a beautiful start to the day. Look at the sun glowing behind us there. Today we are headed to Canyon Land. But before that, I'm gonna make some coffee. Sun is out and vibrant today. It's gonna be a beautiful day to go exploring in Canyonlands. We're gonna be packing it up here pretty quick and getting out of here so that we can go see some more nature. So these days, if you're seeing a drone shot where the camper's going down the road, Captain Marissa's behind the wheel so that Pilot Eric can fly the drone. This morning, we're headed out to Canyonlands right now. Did a little work inside of the camper earlier, but we're gonna go do a hike today. Do you know how long our hike is? No, I'm not sure which hike we're gonna do yet. We have to see uh, the trailhead and how much parking there is because different hikes only have limited amount of parking spaces and then that'll defeat the purpose of being able to do that hike if we can't park there. Hopefully we're able to find a spot and go do some hiking, but for now, check out this drone footage.
there's an insane amount of traffic on our way into Canyonlands today. So while we're sitting here, I walked into the back of the camper, grabbed a whole thing of cashews for a snack, and I'm just watching some Mav on my phone, courtesy of Starlink on the roof. We're on a hill here, so because the traffic's so bad, I've got the truck off, and I've been just putting it in neutral, letting us glide downhill until traffic stops again, and putting it in park. We're getting infinity miles per gallon right now. Brakes are actually starting to feel soft there on that one. Had to fire it back up. We just got to a campground here. Uh, we're not sure we're definitely going to stay here, but most likely. But we wanted to make a bite to eat before we went out for a hike. So we have some egg bites from Costco. They are... Three Bridges Uncured Ham and Cheese Egg Bites. We're cooking those up now. Marissa's cooking me up some delicious Costco rotisserie chicken with some teriyaki sauce on it. So I can get that protein in and get some food in my belly before we go out and check out the sights. These views from here are pretty spectacular. Had a super nice day out on the dirt bike, checking out Canyonlands today. It's been a little bit difficult, as you can imagine, to film a vlog while in a national park where we're not supposed to film. But we've been here at our campsite, and it's a beautiful, beautiful location. You've got 360 degree panoramic views, all these canyon walls and mountains. Tonight for dinner, we have a delicious shrimp stir fry dish with veggies. So we have for the sauce, it's a combination of tamari, peanut butter, sriracha seasoning, and salt and pepper. It's pretty good. Nice and spicy with a little bit of a kick. Tamari, for those who don't know, is basically soy sauce, but for healthy people. The peanut butter is definitely the most prevalent flavor of the whole dish, which is fine. I'm not opposing that, but it's very peanut butter forward starting to rain also which i didn't realize was coming but wash some of the dirt off the top of our camper and off our solar panels ben just hanging out here with Hayes, doing some editing and marissa's already in bed it's a whopping 8 30. so tired her out today riding around on the dirt bike and being out in the sun, and honestly, we're both still hurting from yesterday's hike. We didn't know that we were gonna be going uphill quite as much as we were, and our legs are feeling it from that hike. And for the rest of the night, it's gonna be just me finishing up some editing and then headed to bed also. Pick you guys up tomorrow when we head out of Canyonland National Park. Good morning. It is a spectacular morning outside. It is beautiful, cold, crisp, Slept so good here in Canyonlands last night. Marissa is still in bed. I'm up doing some computer work. And we're gonna get ready to get out of here this morning after drinking some coffee and packing ourselves up. video be sure to like this video subscribe turn on notifications and we'll see you next time from salt lake city bye